how is it to be in the same company as your boyfriend? Te dance e hoje o vídeo tá em clima de romance, de amor, na dança, claro. A gente convidou nosso ex-aluno Denilson Almeida, que hoje é bailarino do Royal Ballet lá em Londres. Vocês já conhecem ele por aqui, né? Vou deixar, inclusive, aqui embaixo, linkado, uma entrevista que a gente fez com ele há pouco tempo, ele contando algumas coisas da Royal, até salário, tudo, ele contou tudo. Então vocês cliquem lá, mas depois de ver esse vídeo, vê até o final, depois vocês vão lá assistir. E a gente convidou ele porque ele namora a Madison, que também é bailarina do Royal Ballet. Então os dois trabalham juntos, namoram, e a gente ficou curioso de saber como é a rotina de dois bailarinos, assim, numa grande companhia e que são namorados. Será que eles fazem mais pra DD porque eles são namorados? Será que isso interfere na escolha dos papéis na hora que eles vão pro palco? Enfim, a gente deixou uma caixinha de perguntas lá no nosso Instagram e muita gente mandou, e aí a gente mandou pra eles responderem tudo que vocês querem saber. E aí, se você não participou dessa vez da caixinha, não deixa de ir lá seguir a gente no Instagram, porque a gente de vez em quando coloca essas coisas por lá pra vocês interagirem, já que aqui a gente não tem comentário, e trazer novas coisas pro canal. Então não deixa de seguir a gente no Instagram. E aproveitando os meus pedidos por aqui, já vou pedir pra você se inscrever nesse canal, porque a gente tá sempre com conteúdos novos e você sendo inscrito, você recebe uma notificação, né, dizendo que tem conteúdo novo, tem vídeo novo, então pra você não perder nadinha, já se inscreve no canal, curte esse vídeo. Então agora acompanha aí Denilson e Madison respondendo essas perguntas no clima do dia dos namorados, no romance. Aproveita Oi, gente, tudo bem? Eu sou o Denilson, ex-aluno da Petit Dance, e eu tô aqui com a minha namorada, como é dia dos namorados hoje, e a Petit Dance pediu pra gente fazer esse vídeo, contando um pouco da nossa história e contando um pouco de como é a nossa rotina. Nós dois somos bailarinos do Royal Ballet, fomos estudantes da Royal Ballet School e estamos aqui pra falar um pouco pra vocês e responder algumas perguntas que vocês mandaram. E o vídeo vai ser todo em inglês, eu sei que é meio chato mas, pra ficar lendo, mas a gente achou que seria mais legal porque tem uma, vai ser uma dinâmica mais natural. Vamos lá, vou pedir pra ela se apresentar. Ok, present yourself. I just said, I just said it's Happy Valentine's Day and right. Hi everyone, I'm Maddie. I'm from Royal also and I'm Danielle's girlfriend. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so how long have you guys been together? So it's three. been, it's been about three, three years. years. I think. Yeah, and we've known each other for almost, almost four. four. So three years, nine months. About. About. <laughs> So, how did you guys meet? <laughs> um, we were dance partners for so long. Yeah. Like, we always have been, I think, from first year. Yeah, oh, from my, my first year here, I joined school. And Maggie was already at school. So, she, she had been through White Lodge. And I didn't even speak English properly. And We were danced to, we danced together. Yeah. We were put on together by the teachers and we Because of heights. Yeah. Yeah, because of just because of heights. And then we were literally just friends. Yeah. And you started started fancying me. No, okay. <laughs> <laughs> How is you guys like routine? The same uh, or we, different? Yeah. Quite similar. Quite similar. Right yeah. now, we we have like the same schedule, pretty much. I think. Yeah, and then. But we don't do class together. No. No. Yeah, we have yeah. similar routine right now because we're all we're both doing the same pieces um, at work and things. Yeah, so but it also it can be different sometimes. You yeah. Pieces that she'll be involved and I won't, and then pieces that I will be involved and she won't. Yeah. And we both also members of the same gym. So there is a gym in the company, but we use another one as well. So sometimes we manage to go together. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we'll find time between our schedule to see each other during the day yeah. as well. Yeah. And I always come to her house. This is her house and, and she comes to mine. Mostly you come here. <laughs> <laughs> How is it to be in the same company as your boyfriend? Nice. 
<laughs> it's nice. I mean, yeah. I think when we first found out that we were coming to company at school, we were a bit like wary and scared of how what would happen if we didn't get into the same company. Um, and then obviously when we found out, it was kind of like such a shock, but we were so happy. Like, because Daniil's like, also, like you know, you're my boyfriend, but you're like my best friend as well. So I think having that best friend around you really helps, especially yeah. in your first year. Yeah, you it was... You feel a bit lonely sometimes. Yeah, and during the, the school you know, period, we didn't know what company we were no. gonna join. So it was always very scary, as you said. And I think in third year, when we knew we were gonna find out, it was a very like, we both were very like, mm -hmm. wow. And then when we got told, we got told at the same time, and both of us went to speak to the director, and we were like, uh, wow. Yeah, we just looked at each other like, this is real. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually happening. <laughs> because it's very, the odds of, it happening like yeah. two boyfriend and girlfriend going to the same company. I think we were the only couple that went to the same company in our year. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And it was and also everyone like the school staff and our friends were like, so Oh nice. my god, you guys are together. Yeah, so, it was so yeah. nice. And the fact that we've been dancing since first year until now, like we're still dancing together in the company, like you know, we have sleep and beauty rehearsals next week and we're even put together for that. So there's always like we always yeah. together. <laughs> That's also another question. They asked if um, are you always dancing together because you're girlfriend and boyfriend. Right now, I think yeah. we are. Yeah. Obviously, we'll probably have opportunities to dance with other people, which will also be nice. And I think it's because um, of COVID as well. They yeah they try to put um, life partners together as well. Yeah. But you have you're doing Valentina's piece with someone else and yeah so there's always it's always a mix but i think they they usually like the idea of boyfriend and girlfriend doing together mm -hmm. so for being girlfriend and boyfriend do you think there's more emotion um when you're dancing together i'll probably do that mm, yeah i think so i think so yeah <laughs> yeah. i think we're more comfortable with each other so like yeah and um, for me and danielson i think because we've been dancing together for so long, you kind of get used to how Daniil partners me and how I dance with him. And I think now we don't really think so much about the dancing and the partnering side. It's more about like feeling, you know, like yeah. if there's meant to be an emotion, it's easier for us because we have more of a connection. Whereas like when you don't have much of a connection with someone, it's harder to like, Get into get, it. Yeah. Get yeah, into definitely. It. And even the, as you said, the, in the technique and stuff, we're more comfortable with each other to yeah. like say like, oh, do this and do that. Because <laughs> sometimes being in a company with so many experienced dancer, dancers, yeah, you get scared to tell them like, can you put me in my leg? Like, can you do that? Yeah, definitely. And you feel like comfortable when it's just yeah. us. Yeah, definitely. Okay, next one. Okay, what's the best and worst part of dancing and being broken? I want to hear this from you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Uh, what's the best and worst? <laughs> <laughs> I think the best thing for me, I think the like emotion side of it. You know, yeah. like it's a lot. Eat, like. We find it so much fun to dance together, don't we? We do, yeah, like, we have fun. We have fun, like it's not just like having to learn a part of the day, like we, we, have, we actually have fun doing yeah. it together, don't we? Definitely. I think the worst part, <laughs> we oh. get into like, we get into arguments <laughs> a little bit when things don't go right. It's yeah. more me. <laughs> <laughs> and also there is a, in the same question, what is the most fun thing about it? sharing that together like being on stage not like we've not really had like an opportunity so much yet to do that but i know maybe like in the future we'll have the chance to be able to properly perform together to on at the opera house I think that was, yeah, that was a part that we did um, at school that we did together 
on, on stage was on quite stage fun. and that was fun like sharing big experiences i think that's really nice yeah what roles would you like to then see at the one day romeo and juliet i think oh. would be really nice we learned the part of there at school and i thought it was like so beautiful i thought the like, connection oh i've got so, so many nice. manon manon love manon and sylvia like that yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, voice of spring like spring any. waters yeah that too uh, oh, there's loads so many we like we really like learning part so of us and just like practicing them and making videos. Cinderella was fun. Cinderella. Yeah. Yeah, so many. So many. <laughs> so were there any like interference from our teachers in our relationship? Um, I actually don't think they did. Like they uh -huh. were at upper school, they treat you quite like maturely, don't they? Yeah. They... In that kind of respect. They don't really like your outside life is very separate from like ballet life at school. Like we didn't actually see each other that much. No. Like we had separate rehearsals. I don't think really many people knew until like our final year. Yeah, that's true. Um, even I think then, we, we're also very like respectful. Like we were yeah. a very respectful couple. And we we're also trying to, you know, um, respect our teachers or like we'd never like, you'd never kiss at school. like. <laughs> well, we'd, we'd never let teachers see it. <laughs> if we're anyway. Anyway. <laughs> but we were very respectful and and all the teachers really liked us. We were like, you know? Yeah. Like, yeah, that's yeah. true. So, I think we were lucky in that. And then some like ballet teachers, they only found out in the final year. And, and they the didn't say anything. No, in they the company, didn't. like... They do not care at all. There's no. so many couples in the whole thing. So many. Like, we have one among um, so many. Yeah. <laughs> we get called like a married couple, don't we? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> How did the relationship affect your performance in your ballet life? I wouldn't say we've had many problems like that, really. The only time I can think of is when had a bit of like a an argument before we went on stage. Would you say that affected you? Like dancing? No, but I feel like it was a bit awkward. Okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Should be. Mine is cute. Yours is not good. Okay, can we cut that? Can we do that again? <laughs> no, it's actually really good. No, no, cut. <laughs> no. Say it again. No, don't. <laughs> no, let me do mine. Mine, I'd say it was affected in a good way because I always say, I, I've said that to people in Brazil so many times and how she is the most like, like, how do you say it? Like, Amazing. <laughs> <laughs> she's the most educated person I know, like, by, yeah, many years. And you, she inspired me so much. The first time I saw, like, acknowledge her person was when I walked. <laughs> When I watched her dancing at school this first year and I was injured so I wasn't dancing so I got to watch it and she was doing this solo birthday offering and it was it was just amazing like all the people <laughs> watching it we were like wow I like her arm like your arm oh, I messed up I know I know it's green just <laughs> as hell <laughs> but it was it was so good and I remember being like Oh my god, she's so good. And like since then, you've inspired me so much, like ballet wise. And I, I love ballet, I love watching ballet. And I think since then, I was like, and I love watching you during class, during class. And I was like, Whoa. Ah. so have you do, have you ever danced with other like partners? Yes, yeah, yes, we have, yeah, a few times. A few times, like, you went to, I went to Pre de Lausanne to do like the interval pieces. I did a different like dance to Danielson. Yeah. Danielson did Rhapsody Parada with one of our classmates. And then I did another dance, what was it called? Um, <laughs> uh, a dance anyway. 
I'm with another boy. So Ashley yeah. Pages. Ashley Pages P. Lorena Waltz. Lorena Waltz. <laughs> Are you jealous? Am I a jealous person? Don't you answer the question. <laughs> yes. I think Me too. I think every relationship has jealousy. Yeah. Yeah, we get some better. some more than others, like. But we kind of make fun of it more than. Yeah, we we yeah. we joke about it. Like, there's obviously things, you know, more deep things that we get jealous over. But most of the time, we just yeah, joke about yeah. it because it's funny. We're professional. <laughs> We're professional. <laughs> <laughs> Question? <'Cause I> really <laughs> <laughs> um, has a relationship ever interfered your? Oh yeah, yeah. Um, so I feel like not mm -hmm. really, because yeah. it's not like we're together 24 seven, like we try and make time for each other when we have breaks and so no, I feel like not really, like it's no, been. Yeah. And yeah, I agree. I had to know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I, we also had to learn to be, um, you know, individuals mm. and we know, we know we're a couple and we love each other, but we're also two individuals with different lives mm -hmm. that and he respects that a lot and we just try to make space for both of us during our timetable yeah and we do it really well yeah do you rehearse or, or like train or practice together outside the company sometimes yeah if we're doing something like, together yeah that like, we have to learn more. well we made like a, a reel for instagram like a part of that reel so like there's you know we do things yeah. like that and again that's also like we start learning little like sections from part of the as like that we like so, yeah like, that, but that's, that's not true. really a, a perform like for for royal ballet thing no know? that's just for us but he said like oh we practice do we practice mm, like, yeah. and, like that counts kind of thing yeah. <laughs> oh you <ain't. laughs> what was the most difficult thing for the book for both of us coming into the company, like joining the company, what was mm. the hardest thing and might still be? Um, I think I have two. I think the first thing would be like coming from school, you get everything given to you at school. You get corrections, you get like technique, whereas in the company you progress into a person, um, how is it like a your own person so you have to be you have to you learn own, to yeah. teach yourself you correct yourself you work on what you want to work on and you you find like the sparkle in you for me the first thing is very there like learning how to be um on your own learning that was was hard and serious <laughs> yeah and like learning how to, to check your own timetable and so everything is there and you have to do it no one's gonna do it for you no. what are the plans for the future i really want to get a dog <laughs> <laughs> i really want a dog how about professionally oh <laughs> get a dog <laughs> um yeah it's nice. still like i feel like I really like, want to get a contract, like a fully yeah. co full contract. Yeah. And I feel like now for us is a, it, we don't really have to think a lot about the future, and more yeah. like about right now, to grow into your future. If mm. you like, if you know what I mean, because we just got here, and we have to settle in. Yeah. And uh, I feel like we just. And because of the whole COVID situation yeah. at the minute, like it hasn't been a normal year. So I think next season, when we start our like second year, we'll get, I know we'll feel a lot more, more yeah, like, involved and comfortable with like, with that. So I feel like my our, our plan now is to settle in. To se well, yeah. yeah. And then for like next season, it would be, you know, to get our full contracts because I know we all want them. So we all apprentices and we, we earn the salary and we, we do the same as a corps de ballet. But it's like, it's a year that we use to settle the dancers in and then after this one year contract, the director talks to us and see if we're gonna keep, if he's gonna keep us in the company or not. So that's something that we're working, we're all working on 
which is to stay in the company. Yeah. <laughs> so that's what we mean by settling in. So that's it. Um, these were all the questions. So I think I'm gonna ask you to try to say some things in Portuguese oh, God, no. now. Yeah, I think to end it. <laughs> Tell us the things you already know that, that I've already told you. Okay. Just <laughs> <laughs> checking. Um, tudo bem? <laughs> tudo bem. I get really embarrassed if how's I say it, it wrong. How's it? Because there's so many followers on it. <laughs> how's how's good night? Boa noite. <laughs> Boa noite. Yeah. Boa noite. Oh, I, get, I always get that wrong. Yeah, but it's good. Um. Uh, well, it's, yeah. That's it. Você? Yeah, you. Like, tudo bem? And then you go, você? No? You você, yeah, you você. você. How I love you, how about Te amo. She's good. <laughs> now, I, will, I think, um, say, um, <laughs> Happy Valentine's Day, which is Feliz. Feliz dia, dia dois, dois namorados. Oh my god! <laughs> Say it really well. So you go out quick, you go like, Feliz dia dos namorados. Can you go slower? <laughs> go with me, go with me. Feliz, Feliz dia, dia dois, dois namorados. Namorados. Yeah. So, feliz, feliz dia, 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 dois, dois, namorados, namoradas, dois. dois. <laughs> so hard! Now go quick. Feliz dia dos namorados. No, I mean... <laughs> feliz dia, dois, namorados. That's perfect. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Anyway. Happy Valentine's Day! Happy Valentine's everyone. Day! It was really nice making this video for you and make sure you follow and like the video and follow us on Instagram <laughs> <laughs> and follow Petite Dance as well so you can see everything that's coming up and thank you and sorry for making this video all in English Yeah, <laughs> sorry! Muito obrigado gente, um beijo, beijo Petite Dance, eu amo muito vocês, minha escola do coração e eu vejo vocês na próxima, espero que tenham gostado do vídeo.